how cute. <laughs> Look at that one. Hey guys, happy Sunday. It's Sunday. I am very happy because I just got off work. Oh, that's where I was yesterday. That spa over there. Utopia. But as I was saying, I'm happy that I'm off work because it's busy as heck. So I'm just glad that I'm home now and it's a beautiful day. Because the whole morning when I was at work, it was kind of cloudy anyway. So I'm glad that when I got off work, it was sunny. We are on our way to the zoo today. I'm starting the vlog a little late just because, you know, I was at work all day. How was your day, babe? Uh, it was alright, I guess. Just chilling, waiting for me? You just waited for me until <clears throat> I got home? Yeah, for sure. Absolutely. You missed me? Absolutely. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I actually haven't been to this zoo, so I'm pretty excited myself. When was the last time you went to the Vancouver Zoo? Oh, a long time ago. When you were a kid? Uh, a lot of things probably have changed, huh? Yeah, it's not like a... Um, I'm trying to... Well, I guess you'll see when you get there, but it's not like a... Because they used to have a zoo at the um, aquarium in Stanley Park. Yeah. It's not like that at all. It's all like open space. Oh, yeah. a train that goes around the oh yeah that's right I saw place. it on their website it's like five bucks per person or something yeah but it's like a, it's all like open field and they just have like fences up so it's cool. not like a little pens that they stay in oh that's good here we are walking up to the zoo daddy went back because he forgot our stall number and we have to pay for parking up front here we are Skylar, say cheese, baby. Skylar, Skylar, look at mommy. Look, Skylar, do you want to see tigers first? Yeah? Please. You see the giraffe? Oh, you're looking at the stork. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> She's more interested in the stork than the giraffe. Just following this little Missy over here. She's leading the way. Come on, baby. Whoa, what is that? It's called a collared Peccary. Yeah? Wow. Well. Well? Seems like a lot of animals today are in hiding. Either we can't find them or they're behind a bush or they're camouflaged with something. Ooh. 
She's so excited. <laughs> <laughs> They're just big rats. Skylar, what are those? There's two ponies and a donkey. Flamingos. <laughs> Say hi, flamingos. Big one. Is that an ostrich? Is that an ostrich? Wow, Skylar. She's scared. Come on, let's go say hi. Where's her? Up. I gotcha. What's in here? Wild pig. I don't see no wild pig. There it is. How big it is. Look how big this pig is. Holy crap. That's a huge pig. That's not even fat, that's huge. And there's the rest of them over there. What does the goat say? Huh? <laughs> Good job! Skylar has something to give you. Oh yeah, what? Skylar, give it to Dada. Aww. Sweet. Thank you. It's a buttercup. Where are you going to put it? <laughs> On your hat. That's a good spot. Good as any. What's that, honey? <laughs> this girl thinks it's funny. When she touches my face, oh my gosh, no, Skylar. Ah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> ah. Ow, my hair. Ow, oh, I'm being abused by my baby. <laughs> Ow, dear Lord. Thank goodness I'm not wearing hoops. Ow. Oh, she did take off my earring. Skylar pulled my earring off. And now I'm looking for the backing. Otherwise, I'll take my earring off. Where's the backing, baby? Oh, oh wait. <laughs> it's in my shirt, you guys. Perfect. The belly saved my earring backing, or whatever you call this. Okay. Belly saved it. We'll put it back okay, and cool. all is good. There we good. Say hi dear. Hi dear. Hi. Oh <gasps> dear. What does the deer say? I don't know what they say actually. What does the deer say? <laughs> Everything is ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Huh? Wow. Wow. Say hi, dear. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Go find Bambi.
Skyler, come over here. Let's go this way. I'll take her. Much the last leg of our day, but we're still here at the zoo and they have a little playground. So we decided to sit under the shade so that way Skylar can play there. And she's already there. Wanting to go on the slide. Can you guys see? Chris made some turkey and avocado sandwiches. We got some banana nut muffins and apple muffins. Yeah, we got juice. some fruits. Skylar's juice. And uh, some potato salad. Ooh, potato salad. And we have some grapes, some mangoes. And there's baby bells in here too. Oh, and some cheese for Skylar too. Come here, baby. Let's go eat. Come here. Okay. Ready? <laughs> <Wee>. <laughs> Was that fun? Look, baby, what's that over there? Ooh, what's that? It's okay, don't be scared. It's okay. <laughs> She's gripping my hand really She's tight. Coming to get you. She's coming to get you because you're not eating. I've made a new friend. His name's Petey the Peacock. Skylar's scared of it. Yeah. <laughs> Sky, <laughs> Skylar, Skylar went Klingon. So this is how I'm eating right now. And look, there he is. And there's Skylar. And there's the bird. Because Chris fed the peacock. Some grapes. Oh, and FYI, peacocks like grapes. Do you like grapes? Seriously, Pete, answer me. Um, Pete's friend has showed up. We're gonna be surrounded by the peacocks later. Yeah, we're gonna get we're gonna get real pushy too. You and you. Tell them about the story when you went to Stanley Park and you you got. Uh, attacked by seagulls or something? Was it No, seagulls? it was geese. Oh, geese. Canadian geese. I effing hate Canada geese. <laughs> they are a-holes. All of them. Because he got attacked by it. Yeah, because I got attacked by geese. Yeah. Did you know that uh, they can break a man's leg with one of their wings? No. That's a fact. Well, that one's more brightly colored. That's a brightly colored ones are females, all right? Males. Oh, males. That, uh, females are like brown and plain, plain Jane. They're like the girl next door, whereas male peacocks mm -hmm. are like. Do you want your grape? I don't know, something flashy dashy. Okay. Monkeys, what does a monkey say, Skylar? 
<laughs> Good job. They're so cute. How cute. Look at that one. Therapist. She focused more on my legs because I'm always on my feet at work and my shoulders because they were pretty tense and um, she got rid of some of the knots which I didn't even know I had so it was really nice and I don't feel like passing out 